Chairman, Vice President, distinguished academicians, fellows of the Academy. Um, I personally am delighted to be here today with my colleagues from Cosmos uh, to be a part of starting what I hope will be a long-term relationship with the Academy of Arts and Sciences. Uh, Mr. Kwame Pianin, our very good friend, is the catalyst to us being here today, and I would like to thank him for being that catalyst and bringing this association together. Thank you, Kwame. <laughs> when, uh, when Kwame first encouraged us to meet with uh, Professor Sawyer, I had a very limited knowledge of, of the Academy and its works, and it, it didn't take him long to educate me. Uh, about this long-standing body. As you've already pointed out, Madam Chairman, the, uh, the Academy was formed only uh, two years after independence, and it's now in its 56th year of making substantive, significant contributions to national development. Um, Professor Sawyer provided me with uh, information once we'd had the first meeting, and I read it with extreme interest and understand what an august body this is, formed of a wide range of high quality expertise, represented by, by some of you here today, which brings a lot to bear in terms of national development across the whole spectrum of the arts and sciences. And I appreciated that um, there was a lot that had been done that was not in the public domain, which has led us to be here today. And he pointed out in a, in a subsequent correspondence, of course, that uh, one of the most recent interventions you have been made, made was in the uh, Ebola uh, virus disease and the plans that the government had relative to uh, vaccine testing in the country. And I certainly understand that the intervention based on some learned uh, documentation that was provided gave cause for pause for thought and, and reconsideration of that to make sure that whatever was done was done with the best information to hand. And that, as I have read further into your history, and I appreciate is, is very indicative of the types of expertise and interventions that you've successfully been able to bring to bear across, as I say, the spectrum of the arts and sciences over the uh, 56 years of your existence. He also pointed out, of course, that you have been facing some uh, funding issues and uh, the request was if, if we could find a way to, to support you in, in addressing some of those issues. Now, at the time when we first met, we were already well into our, our budget year and uh, I indicated that we certainly wished to provide support, but perhaps we could only take a small step at the beginning but I do see this small step that we're initiating today as just the first of many steps as we develop this relationship over the years and become, I hope, a long-term and substantive contributor to the ongoing benefits that the Academy can bring to bear. Uh, Madam Chairman, you pointed out that publications and getting the information to a wider audience has been a challenge, part of those funding issues where it did not allow you to get into the, the public domain in the manner that you wish to, and that is where we find our opportunity to take that first small step by providing the funding that we hope will allow you to address the backlog and to get the uh, many publications, the books, the seminars, the lectures that have been given, the studies that you've made, the interventions you've made in many areas into the public domain to provide a wider scope of education to the country at large to understand the capabilities that exist in this academy and hopefully promote further utilization of those capabilities for your finding principle of national development and of course your, your motto of promote, promoting excellence in knowledge. I think that is an extremely worthy cause, excellence in knowledge. Without knowledge there, there's very little that can be done in the way of development and I think promoting excellence in knowledge is a major stepping stone to ongoing development in the great country of Ghana. So it is my pleasure today to be able to present our check to cover 
the uh, publication needs that were presented to us by Professor Sawyer. I'm very pleased to actually indicate that because of the vagaries of the exchange rate, that the amount that we, uh, we had budgeted for, the 130,000 CDs, has actually become 144. <laughs> so maybe we can make a little contribution to one of those other areas that you're missing. But Madam Chairman, if I may ask you, I'd like to uh, have the honor of, of presenting the check to you. Um, the big one, I'm not too sure the bank will accept this one, but, but certainly I, I have the, the real check. But here it is, 144,210. So if we get all together, yes? <laughs> so with, uh, with great respect and gratitude, we present this check to you, and we hope it will allow that knowledge to get to the wider audience, and we hope this will be many years of association for the greater good of Thank you. Thank you. I'm also delighted to be the first the first delegation to come to your new auditorium. Yes. Uh, that's a, a memorable occasion for us. Thank you have you. made history. Indeed. <laughs> thank you very much. It's a pleasure. Thank you. Kami, it's a good point you on the spot to say a word or two uh, because uh, as we said earlier, before you got here, he has been very instrumental in making this thing you know, happen. And uh, Kwame is a man that, yes, exactly. So I would rather, you know, he uh, says a few words. He is the primary catalyst, as I said. <laughs> First of all, let me apologize for the delay in this point. I was chairing the Finance Committee of the Petroleum Commission, so it took longer than I had planned. But it's very impressive and refreshing to enter uh, to see the new auditorium. So at least for once, Ghana is trying to give recognition to the fact that brains matter and that thinking matters. Uh, I think one of the things that has been dragging Ghana back uh, from continuing to be in the, uh, the trailblazer for Africa is the fact that we plan badly. We don't do, use knowledge effectively. Uh, just two days ago, I got a, a publication uh, that indicates what people like Ayukoyama and the others have been saying for the longest possible time, that the Egyptian civilization of Kemet was a nation of blacks, and that most of us migrated from there. Now, DNA test has revealed unequivocally that the kings of Uganda, Ramsey of Egypt, when they did the DNA test, definitely uh, put it there. And some of their cultures are there. And then you create has been saying, you call it hieroglyphics. The sun is a real. Your place is built. And our cultures are very similar. So at least we are recovering some of our social memory, which will help us with the African Renaissance. So I'm very happy that Cosmos is a great nation. They discovered oil for us. Not only that, they already exceeded the local content of Petroleum Commission by being the first of their own companies to have 100% Ghanaian representation. And we are very also happy uh, to see that they've been providing a soft landing for a reversal of the brain drain. <laughs> but I'm hoping that this is the beginning because what I would like to see is that a lot of the tests related to earth sciences, chemistry, physics, that are being shipped to be done in Houston, UK, US, Scotland, will be done here, either in the CSR or at the universities, so that US, K and USD can specialize either in physics, Legon chemistry, and one of them in the geology and so forth, so that we do the test here.
first class equipment, and this is the beginning. That's why I wanted to introduce these people to you, and hopefully, for the Academy of Arts and Sciences, once the brain begins to follow the feet and legs, we can so can thank you very much for pushing to make this. And he said, it's small. I said, it doesn't matter. Once you go knock and you see the lady, you come to get married. So thank you very much. <laughs> thank you very much for sharing with us, Mr. Family. You are really the catalyst. Behind all that is happening here today, we are really good. Now, this is a check for the publications. So, we in the Ghana Academy of Arts and Sciences, we are thanking Cosmos M for this generous gesture. It's very generous because what we are seeing is not 144,000 cities, as he said, but we are seeing a seed that is being sold. A small seed is sown today, and it yields, becomes a big tree, and yields fruits upon fruits upon fruits. So, the money that we have received today is a seed, which we are very grateful for. And like all of you have been saying, we are not looking at today or this afternoon, but we are looking at the value beyond what we have given today. And we are looking forward that, as Ken said, this will be just one step of the many steps to come. So we are very grateful to Cosmos Energy for this gesture. And we are looking for a long-term relationship between our two organizations. Having said that, I want also to ensure you that the academy will be forever intact with you so far as Cosmos Energy and Ghana Academy exist. At the moment, reforms are underway in the academy by the newly elected council to rebrand the academy and change the ways of working, to make it even more functional and more efficient. In this respect, your grant will go a long way in helping us to publish a backlog of manuscripts and papers and put them in the public domain for all to enjoy, not only uh, institutions and organizations in Ghana, but throughout uh, the world, in academia, development agents, and so on. So the seed money will really go very far. And it is definitely the beginning of the good things that are yet to come in the academy. So it is my fervent hope that this relationship that we are, uh, I don't want to say still, we are beginning, we are sown today, will continue to cement our organizations together and work together for the benefit of uh, our organizations and for the country as a whole. Once again, Cosmos Energy, accept our sincerest gratitude for your efforts and your assistance to make the academy viable by your presentation this afternoon. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> 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 <laughs>